What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to Duty's Backyard Builds. Hope everyone is doing fine. So, before I forget, I did receive my 1986 Pontiac Grand Prix 2 Plus 2 back from MIA Motorsports. As y'all seen on one of my previous videos, I took my Grand Prix to MIA Motorsports to get my whole twin turbo pipe fabrication done. They finished, I love the way it came out. I want you guys to stay tuned on my next video. I'm gonna give you guys a whole walkthrough, everything update on my Grand Prix and show you guys how everything came out. It came out amazing, guys. So um, definitely gonna give you guys an update on my next video. But today, what we got going on today, as y'all seen on one of my previous videos, we removed the complete suspension on my brother's 1986 Monte Carlo SS. So today, we're gonna clean the whole chassis, undercarriage, get everything painted, and we're gonna be installing the complete new suspension on the Monte Carlo SS. Yep, we got UMI upper and lower control arms for the front, six piston wheel, wheel brakes in the front, QA1 adjustable coilovers all around, quick performance four nine inch in the back with a four piston wheel, wheel brake setup, UMI anti-roll bars, UMI upper and lower control arms, shock tower brace all the extra support you could add to these g bodies we got it and we're going to be installing it today so i want you guys to stay tuned let's get to work guys
finished installing the complete suspension from front to back car is a little bit dirty once we uh put the new wheels on i'm gonna wash her up and she'll be ready to go but um just to go over everything again for the front six piston wood wood brakes umi upper and lower control arms QA1 adjustable coilovers, UMI sway bar, and Pro Forge front steering kit. Show you guys right now. Let me know what you guys think. I told you guys I love coilovers. Main reason you can always adjust your ride height to your preference. You can't beat that, guys. As you see, I still got tape there. I gotta remove the tape. I did paint it. I did wire brush the complete chassis and painted the complete chassis and undercoated the whole undercarriage. You guys know the way I like to do it. I'm not just gonna install the new suspension without cleaning the chassis and painting everything. This is just the way I like to do it, guys. Everything has been painted. Let me show you guys the rear now. All right, guys, as for the rear, this is a quick performance four nine inch. It's actually shoring one inch on each side in order to fit those Forgiato six inch lips. It has a 370 gear ratio with a true tack pause unit. Four piston Woolworth brakes. Got QA1 adjustable coilovers. UMI anti roll bar. UMI upper and lower control arms and a UMI shock tower brace for extra support. That's the complete rear suspension, guys. Let me show it to you guys from the back. There you guys have it. Let me know what you guys think. For those that are wanna know what undercoating that I use, this is the USC rubberized undercoating in the black finish. As you see, it gives it a nice texture leaves it real nice real real nice but um yeah guys everything has been completed the whole front to back suspension has been installed i'm gonna put the new wheels on wash the car and everything and um definitely gonna make sure give you guys a nice little walkthrough once i do that but yeah youtube let me know what you guys think if y'all could please comment below let me know what you guys think, how the car is coming out. Definitely um, gonna give you guys a nice walkthrough once I install the new wheels, remove all the tape and get the car detailed. Let me give you guys a nice walkthrough of the whole car. 
But um, please comment below. Let me know what you guys think. I really appreciate all the love and support. And till next time, guys. Peace.